Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to build another easy build bed. All right. For those of you who have followed my YouTube channel and have followed my um, Facebook page, you'll see that I've been doing a lot of laser kits lately. And these laser kits are going to be listed. The link will be below so that you can purchase it if you want. A lot of you have asked me to do kits in the past and I haven't been able to, but I decided to invest in the laser so that you guys could um, do these kits because some of you don't have access to wood to actually cut the kits. So in the kit, it will have two types of head and foot boards. One will be notched and one will not. Okay, the larger one is the headboard, the smaller one is the footboard. Okay, so on here, you'll have the little um, notch here. That's going to be for the edge of these. And the first thing you need to do is you need to look at the sides. There is a front side and a back side. The front side has a pattern. It looks like wood. It's MDF, but it's printed on there. And what you need to do is you need to use some wood glue. Don't use super glue for this part. If you use super glue, it's going to stick and then you're not going to be able to adjust it to be even. Super glue is not your choice or your um, best choice for this project. Not for this part. We will use super glue later and I'll show you. If you do this in the middle where the little lines are, you won't have the sand in between there to get the glue or to wipe in between there. But you want to go ahead and sandwich them together. Make sure they're nice and even on both sides. Then you want to take the square up tool and you want to make sure you have it square. move my hands out of there so you can actually see so make sure it's squared once you have them even and you have it squared up take some binder clips or these large um, paper clips and you want to double check everything make sure everything's still square, still even, clip the top, then clip the feet, because the feet will try to come apart if you don't, clip the edges, and this has to set up for a few minutes to make sure that it's not going to end up um, sliding. Everything should be even all the way around. It should be uniform, no spacing, no gap. It should not be offset in any way, so you shouldn't see something like that, or you shouldn't see something like that. It should totally be even. All right, now you're going to do the same thing you just did there with the footboard. Now, I'm flattening out this glue on this one just because this one has a little bit more detail to it than the previous beds with the little circles and stuff, and I don't want it to squeeze through the circles. So now I'm going to sandwich them two together, do the same thing we did before and the same thing we've done in previous beds. All of these beds go together relatively simple because they're easy builds. So if you can build one, you can build them all. Put that together. Make sure it's pressed straight down on the table. Use your feeder together. Nothing crooked there. And 
and then clip it just like that. Okay, at this point, the other one should be pretty set up, very close to being set up. So if you notice, there's some little pieces in there. If they do not come off, you're gonna have to sand them. That's just where the glue squeezed through. And it should look just like that. Okay, now you're gonna take the crazy glue, the Loctite Super Glue, and you're gonna squeeze it in that hole. Try not to get it on anything else. Like see how I came out a little bit? You don't want to do that if you can avoid it. All right now you're going to take this with the wood side outside Use your square up tool. Do the same thing here. Now you want to go ahead and put some. there now those two notches where you put the crazy glue you're gonna slide this in and you're gonna put that down in there see I got too much glue so it's squeezed out but the mattress should hide that okay now you're gonna put this on one of these so that it's got a flat surface and you're gonna hold it square Now you're gonna let that sit there for a minute. Unclamp the footboard. I'm gonna take the super glue, put it in the hole. Doesn't wanna come out, and I don't wanna squeeze too much. There we go. Now you're going to set that just like that. Okay, now you want to take and pull the sides away and you want to put that inside of the notches. Push it down in there and then push the sides in. Then you want to hold it straight to where it's squared up and let it dry so it can set up. Okay, once it's set up, you want to turn the bed over and you want to run a bead of glue down the inner edge. Just like that. Take these with the wood side up, put them in place. Wipe off the excess glue before it dries. Put a little drop of crazy glue right there, a little drop of crazy glue right there, 
You can do a drop in the middle if you like. Not necessary, but you can. Okay, now you want to take the small piece and you want to put it right in here. Just like that. And there you have a bed. It should be square and level. So let's check. And there's the bed. If you want to see more kits and everything, or if you have any ideas for kits that I'm going to be making, leave them in the comments below. Share some links of pictures and stuff that you like to see turned into a dollhouse kit. And follow the Facebook page. I post lots and lots of pictures on there before I actually put them on the website. So that's under Dollhouse Miniature Madness and Tutorials. And I will see you next time. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.